<laughs> All right, so we got the uh, sea hug. HDMI cable and the power supply. Connect up to uh, three subs, about uh, one, and then you can get two more if you want. Uh, here you get, looks like, the rear speaker. This is about uh, maybe a foot tall. labeled with letters I guess so uh, that when you have the instructions I guess you know where the left and right go another one in the rear so you get gonna go it's like you get some holes so you can uh, mount it if you want to there's also a reset button power and uh, for the uh, power to go into these are the front speakers. These are about two feet tall, I think. So covered in again uh, cloth. Nice packaging. Wow. I did it. This is the center. This is the center speaker, and it does have some. Looks like some rubber down the bottom, so you can lay it this way and uh, you won't, you know, move around. It's more stable. The mounts in the back. It's pretty heavy, about, about five, four or five pounds, I'd say. These are the fronts. Looks like the left and right. Wow. I bought these on Amazon. Um, so check them out on Amazon if you want to. This is about yeah, it's about the same size. Yeah. These are the yeah left and right speakers it does it does have rubber rubber grips down the bottom do you want some more there's no uh atmos for these uh for the system it's just a 5.1. Hopefully they will uh, later on upgrade to Atmos and just by adding speakers, hopefully, and just upgrade the Santa Hub. But there it is. Center, left and right, rears, and the hefty subwoofer. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, put this together and uh, see how it sounds. I am replacing uh, JBL Cinehub 200 or Cinema 200, 
uh, soundboard system and uh, see how this uh, bad boy sounds.